height. Let's see how to fix the initial heartbeat failed. Restart your game or try again later on fire. Whenever you face this kind of error, you see the screen like this. Fire is well known tool for modifying the grand auto theft we letting players craft their multiplayer adventures. Yet, just like any other software, it may run into the issues such as bothersome initial heartbeat failed error. So why is initial heartbeat failed restart game or try again later on fire? When you see the initial heartbeat failed restart your game or try again later error fire it means that your game client cannot convert connect to the server this can stop you from playing or using the certain features the error happens to for the different reasons for the login problems wrong fire client version server troubles firewall or the antivirus issues or the game file problems you should try to fix the various fixes to find the cause and solve it so let's see how to fix the initial heartbeat failed restart your game or try again later on fiam to fix this issue first restart your fiam check your updates disable the firewall or the antivirus verify the game files and then finally reinstall the application the first method is restart your fiam if you see the initial heartbeat failed error on the fiam try these fixes close the fiam and open it again this simple step can often solve small connection problems and get you back in the game the second method is check for the updates it's important to ensure that the fiam is fully updated to the latest version and check if any updates are available and if so make them to install you want to see if you want to know the updates to check for fiam updates start fiam game client it will look for the updates and ask you to install if it is found visit the fiam anti facts page for the version pick one and then click install after updating restart the fiam to apply the changes the third method is disable the firewall or the antivirus sometimes security features such as firewall or the antivirus software can mistakenly interfere with the application causing the issues such as being unable to change the settings temporarily disable your antivirus software locate the antivirus program on your computer open its settings and disable it temporarily disable your firewall go to the control panel search for the windows defender firewall or the firewall select the appropriate network profile choose the option to turn it off the firewall for the selected profile save the changes and exit the settings fourth method is verify the game file if you have installed the fiam through this steam you can verify the game file for the gta v to check for the corrected game files to verify the game files in the gta v open the game launcher right click on the game select properties the local files tab click on verify integrity of the game files wait for the process to finish launch the game to check for the issue resolution the fifth method is uninstall and reinstall the fiam application lastly if the above solutions with the other troubleshooting methods work for you try to uninstall the fire from your device and then reinstall it again from the official website okay so the official website is fire okay so what you can do is like if you want to uninstall go to the settings go to the apps and select the fire application click on uninstall when it is prompted to uninstall you can click on uninstall so once you have uninstalled it you can download it again from the official website and then again you can download and install it the sixth method is contact the fiam support team if the other troubleshooting methods didn't work for you you can contact the fiam support team support.cfx.org okay so here you can click on submit a request so here you can select help and support here you can enter email id subject description Finally, you can attach the screenshot of the error and finally you can submit it. Tell the experts they can give you the specific guidance to solve the problem. Okay. So, that's all about this. Thank you.